Okay, so there is a new feature to bad coders. It's not actually related to code smells or code quality or performance. It's more like for security reasons. Uh, I called it run strings. Yes, I know it's a shitty name. I had no better idea for it. Um, it the idea of this tool is simply uh, at the start of your server, there will maybe maybe be some backdoor, maybe some DRM that will run code using compile string. I mean, yeah, compile code using uh, compile string, run string. This code is being uh, anyway, um, op maybe fetch from server or maybe run on the fly by your player using a command, I don't know what. And the idea is to see some part of this code. Um, the idea is not to actually get the code itself, like the original one, it's 100% possible with Ditter, but uh, it's not what I wanted to do. Uh, I don't want you to uh, just crack any DRM with this tool. Uh, I don't want to give you any weapon with this tool, only tools. Um, so you need to tick this case for, I mean, this ch checkbox for obvious reasons, as the code will be run at the start of the server. Like, uh, I already spawned eight, maybe one minute ago uh, all the maybe DRM code or, back, or backdoor code already ran, so it's too late. So I need to enable the scan for the next boot. So let's go. Okay, so the performance is going to be 100% destroyed and I do not advise you to run it on your server uh, like the main server with players uh, because they're gonna be mad <laughs> with the performances. Um, so let's open bad coders. I, as you can see I don't have a lot of FPS even if it's going up. Okay, so I got some results here from GLib which are not really uh, an issue. Um, as you can see, there is a suspiciousity level. Uh, anyways, how it works? Uh, if it's a run string with no, l no. Let me show you an example. Uh, okay, so when you do run string, you can specify nothing. It will return. Uh, no, let me show you a better thing. Uh, demo to. Okay. So when you uh, run a card with uh, compile string, compile string, or I mean run string or compile string can specify a, a path for the file um, which will be some kind of identifier or like an ID, I don't know what to call it. As you can see I call it fake shit here uh, which is exactly this. Uh, let's change it to a tomato and it shows tomato. So someone can actually pretend the run string, even if it shows here, is a file, even if it's not. So I'm trying to find if someone is trying to hide the name, maybe hide the run string, etc. And it will assign or uh, set a suspiciousity level, depending on uh, what was detected. Anyway, uh, we can pretty much ignore anything related to glib. Um, here is a cut from Gmod, so we can ignore it. And every time, every yeah, every entries are the same cut that was sent to my server. So it's every time the same thing. Uh, it will not show the exact same cut because, as I said uh, in the um, explanation of the in the add-on, it's decompiled cut. It's not the actual one, but it can help you trying to find some nasty stuff or anything that can be suspicious like any steam id or any if you see like something like super admin admin or whatever uh, you can clearly understand what is going on and that's it